So again, I should be asleep because it's like 3 o'clock in the morning and I have church in the morning. Um, but I just want to share something with you guys. Like, it totally broke my heart. Um, the job that I had this week at the middle school, I'll post videos about that later, it was awful, but I'm not talking about that. Um, so, I was the trash window, and so I could see the whole cafeteria. Well, as they're calling teachers, I hear a teacher's name that I recognize. And I'm thinking, ah, uh, it's probably just a similar name. Well, the next day I hear the same name again. And I look, and it's the teacher that I'm thinking of. My seventh grade history teacher. And I just, my mouth drops open. All these kids are coming to the trash window, and they're just kind of standing there looking at me really funny. And I'm just like, I'm sorry, I just... <laughs> and they're just like... They were, they're really, they're pretty, they're okay. I, I don't mind them much. I wasn't, I didn't have a lot of anxiety towards the kids. It was all the adults. But, anyway. So, Friday... Uh, one of the teachers threw their silverware in my bucket that I'm supposed to wipe the counters off with. And the kid, like, gets on and says, that's, that's me, you should have done that. Anyway, so I take it back to the teacher's lounge where it's supposed to go. And I see my teacher. I walk right by him. I kind of hesitate for a second because I'm like, I could just say hi to him. I'll, I'll just say hi. Don't you remember me? I was in your seventh grade class. But I walk back to the cafeteria and didn't say anything. Because I couldn't. And I thought about that like the rest of the day. Well, at least for the last the next hour. I just kept thinking if I didn't have social anxiety I could have said something. But I just kept thinking I'm overweight. Like I'm a lot more overweight than I was then. Like, I was pretty small then. And so I just think, well, what, is it, what is he gonna think? Gee, she's gotten pretty big. <laughs> Not all. Wide. <laughs> you know, I, mean, I just kept thinking all the things he's gonna be thinking, you know. And I shouldn't have. <sighs> he, um, I don't know if any of y'all seen this show, uh, or the movie, Selena. She was a, um, Latina, um, singer. And in the movie, uh, Jennifer Lopez plays her. She's shockingly, like, similar. Like, she looks a lot like her. But, uh, she was shot by her manager when she was, like, 23, 24. She was really young. Um, she was on stage performing, I believe. Or no, 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 no. In the movie, they show it that way. They make it all dramatic and everything. Well, not that it isn't dramatic, but, um, I think she was in her hotel room or something. She'd gone out to talk to her about money, and she found out that she'd been stealing from her. And that was when the manager took out this gun and just shot her, and it killed her. But, and in this guy's class, my seventh grade teacher, he, he showed that movie to us, and I got to see it all by myself, because I had missed it for some reason, I think I had a meeting or something, I don't know, but I got to see the very ending by myself after school, and it was just, it's one of my favorite movies, it's just so, it's sad, but it's so, like, she was such a dreamer, like, and all her dreams came true, and then that lady shot her. Like, it, it's crazy. But she's a really pretty singer, and I listen to her music sometimes when I think about seventh grade. But, um, even her, like, songs in Spanish, I like some of them. I think one's called Bitty Bitty Bum Bum or something. <laughs> but it's really catchy, but, um, anyway. 
So yeah, that was like super depressing. And it just hurt really bad. And I just kept thinking, what what is it gonna hurt? If I go in there and I say hi to him. Hi. Graduated high school. Have a little bit of college. Um, I was in your seventh grade class. All grown up now. You know, all that. And that probably would have made him feel so good to see one of his students. You know? And I think he's still teaching. Like, it was, what, seven or eight years ago? And he still looks the same. His wife teaches there, too. She's a teacher. I got to meet her a few times when I was in seventh grade. I just, I don't know, it killed me that I couldn't say anything. <sighs> I just want to share that with you guys. That's all.